new horses available to purchase at Scone Meadows and Sandini Stables. But then again, oh wait, maybe now I can actually get the, uh, what do you call it here? At, no, I'm pretty sure it's only Blackwater for the Arabian. But new horses are available here. Not like I really want one, because apparently I have, like, the top of the line heckin' horse. Still just under 3k in my inventory. Might as well go here real quick and see what we can do. Do I even have my hats? Yeah, what happened to my heckin' hats? I just need to go back there. Hmm. Hey there, fellers. Theodore Eckhart Stables. Sheesh, look at all the heckin' fog. Hey there. Uh, what are you doing to that horse? What? He's starving. Got some room in the stable here. Starving, you say? You oh. Price. So I guess there is Arabian here, huh? And look at that. Originally 10,000. Sheesh, 10,000. Originally $1,050 I could buy it for nine forty five because of my honor. So it does seem like you can indeed buy Arabians here, so I guess I wasn't complete and utter fake news. Uh, saying that you have to get them in black water. Uh, I guess I was correct saying that, yes, you can get Arabians here in Saint Denis, but because we have a tamed one, it's a little bit different than the ones that you can buy here for basically $1,000. Uh, I don't know how this fares against the one we have tamed. This one's uh, what looks like 6 and 6. I think ours was 6 and 6, wasn't it, for the baseline stuff, huh? I know his info. I guess we could read about it. Superior horse, breed Arabian, black coat, female gender, and Turk. Turk Turkomen? That's 855, originally 950. Race slash war horse, Turkomen gold coat, male gender. And Nakota or Nakata, this is the one that we have. A little bit smaller than the other ones, holy heck. Yeah, I didn't even know it. I thought I thought this would have been the same sound. Maybe this one's just small specifically. But uh The Arabian. The Turkomen is slightly worse than the Arabian. And the Arabian and Nakota. Nakota has slightly better speed and slightly worse acceleration, so a little bit of a trade-off there. Not like I'm really in the market for one, though, so I don't really care. <laughs> Equipment, though. Saddle saddles. I think we already have, like, one of the best, if not the best saddle. I don't know. But uh, everything else, these things are basically cosmetic. I don't really care. I guess if anything, I'm like, we have the heck of money. Let's see, which one... Oh, is that the one I have? Oh, yeah, that's one that we own. I guess we might as well apply it to that if we already own it, right? <laughs> uh, let's see. Different blanket there. Hold on. Which one? Oh, that's the blanket under the horse, I think, right? Yeah. But I can't even see it, so I don't think it even matters. <laughs> better roll. That's the thing on the back, though. Wood, wool, better roll. I can't tell you how many times I use that one. Weather, blah, blah, blah. Canvas, better roll. Yeah, let's use the wool. Why not? It looks cool. Added wool, better roll. Yeah, let's do that one. That looks a lot more count. Let's do the blue. There we go. Or is there like a red? Or, yeah, let's do the blue. Sure, why not? Ivory. There you go. There you are. All right, not bad. Not bad at all. Services, I don't really care. Everything else, I think I have a bunch of horse provisions. Real good one. All right, well, I kind of want to go to the camp or the house or whatever. Yeah, where is that, by the way? Hold on. Where in the world is... Uh, oh, and then over here we have BR, which is Angelo Bronte, which is supposedly where Jack is. Dutch needs you to ask around public places for information about Angelo Bra Oh, it's three different locations. Okay, so one of them's a saloon. One of them's some sort of... What is that? Joys of Civilization, Dutch... Yeah. Is this the same mission? Joys of Civilization? Uh, yeah, it is. But it's like different locations. So over here in some sort of like city streets, over here in some sort of square, and over here in the saloon. He did say it's probably best to start out with a saloon. Oh yeah, we're speaking of... Where, where's our actual camp at, though? Oh, it's down. Oh! Okay. And then over here is the Catfish Jackson, Jacksons. Over here is the church. Over here is the... The... War place. <laughs> over here is Braithwaite Manor. Of course, I think I can burn down by now. And then, uh, of course, Rose, which... I don't, I don't think it really matters if we go in there with heckin' guns or not, because everyone's heckin' dead. But then again, we said that about uh, Valentine, and, well, seems like... Every Everyone's populated that place again, so who knows? <laughs> Anyways, yeah, we're pretty close to San Denis, our little camp right here at the bottom right. Or bottom, bottom middle, or whatever that is. <laughs> and then, uh, there's like a little border around San Denis, and I, sh I didn't hear anything about Dutch saying, hey, don't, uh, 125, but yeah, I still need to pay that. Didn't hear Dutch say anything about us, like, not having guns or whatever, so I think we're fine. There's a black water over there. Here's Albert Mason, and then, of course, the other, uh, that shootest feller, Emmett Granger. So, I don't know, maybe, maybe next time we do the Albert Mason thing, we can do the Emmett Granger thing, too. But for right now, I don't know, I'm kind of wanting to go back. I don't know. I guess we can go to the, yeah, let's just go to the saloon. Let's just go there. 
Sure, why not? Let's set, a, let's set a waypoint there. And there we go. It's not too far, I suppose. Well, like, I guess we could go to whatever the one nearest us is. It doesn't really matter, I don't think. Let's go. I kind of want to go to the saloon, because that's the one that Dutch specifically said. Oh, what in the world? It's that guy again. It's the Gavin guy. Has anyone seen Gavin? Gavin's friend. Hello, sir. Have you seen Gavin? You still haven't found him? Nope. But I won't give up. He's lost. One morning, I just woke up and he wasn't there. Someone must have taken him. Maybe he just left. Gavin? <laughs> no. No. We were best mates. I mean, really, best mates. He'd never leave me. Never. Gavin! <laughs> All right. Uh, I am okay, so girl. worried. Gav! <laughs> cool little Gav. meme. I wonder if I would have, because we saw him in Rhodes. I wonder if I missed him back in like Valentine and stuff. Because it seems like he's following us in different towns. Just happens to pop up in Rhodes, and now he just happens to pop up here in Zandini. See if we can outrun this here tram. Oh, well, there we go. Oh, sheesh. Don't run into anyone. Don't want to attract any attention. Alright, let's go to the- Oh wait, that is a saloon back there. Oh, whatever. Alright. We're already heading to this other one, so it doesn't really matter too much, I suppose. Yeah! Don't run into the trash can! Wait, whoa, whoa, what happened? Let's see if we can get on the good side of the law. Seems like someone's getting chased. You can't cross the law and live! What happened? I hear you. Oh, oh shit. Shit. That's how a lawman solves a problem. No, this can't be it! Wait, what? Oh, he killed him. Oh, there's an X on the map. Now that's what I call a good day's work. What the hell happened? Just let the law handle this. Don't worry. Sheesh. Yeah. Don't ask questions. She. You just go around beating the tar out of anyone you please? You really want to mess with me? I just got hated, that's all. Think twice before you trouble me again. Golly. You're just another dirty pig. I have had it with you. Uh-oh. Hey, mister. This town has had enough of the likes of you. Uh-oh, get on our horse, let's go. Go. Come on, girl. Oh. Oh, jeez, I just ran into someone. <laughs> I think we're good. I think we're good. Let's just go. Just forget about it. Let's go. Is that even? Oh, it's unavailable. Oh my God. Count the seconds you got left. Oh, sheesh. Oh man, he wants to fight. Oh man, my honor. Oh my God. Unarmed assault. What? Let me put on my mask in the middle of the second fight. Oh no, the crime's reported. Oh jeez, I'm dead. Heck, a police guy back there. I'm running. I'm running. Arthur Morgan. Oh, God. Come on. Man. Oh, go. Go, go, go. Holy, get on the horse and run. Oh, no need to drag no They already have my heckin' face reveal. They already have my name and everything, so sheesh. Just go. I'm like, wait, they already have my face. They have my name. I'm sure, even if they don't find me, I still have a bounty. I'm sure, right? Oh, jeez. I just got caught again. How'd that even happen? What? Anyways, might as well, uh, there you go, put on a mask. There you go. <laughs> am I wearing a mask? I think, oh, yep, I am. Okay, that's good. Learn to use a what? Learn to use a road? I don't know. <laughs> it's not like I need to use a road right now. I'm trying to escape. Is that the Gavin guy again? No, it's not. I thought it was. <laughs> Alright, hopefully now we're going to escape him. Evade him. Yep. Well, while well, we're just kind of waiting here, let's see if we can get a little bit of a... Oh, what is this? Yeah, sure, why not eat that? Get a I'm like, I don't even need my cores up too much. Oh my god, I got caught again! Oh, jeez! Somehow he knows me, even though I have my icon mask on. Golly! Oh, jeez! Oh, oh my god, go! Get on the horse, get on the horse. Where, where are you going? Where are you going? Oh! I've got a $5 bounty, I need to run! Holy! Sheesh! Man, I lost my alligator skin. Whatever, I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. Just keep going. Just escape. Man. That really escalated for no reason. <laughs> Alright, we good? Oh god, there's a police guy like right. Yep, I knew it. Jeez, $5 bounty. 
for what? Unarmed assault, even though I was defending myself. Oh golly. Man! Police guys all day. Yeah, this is this is one of the things about San Denise that we're gonna have problems with all the heckin' police all over the place. They're just crawling everywhere. Sheesh. I don't think we can escape it as easily as like Santa or, or no, not Santa Denis, but uh, Valentine or Road or anything like that. Even though roads we were kind of are part of the police, I guess you could say, the sheriffs. We were heckin' deputies. <laughs> okay, it seems like we're good now. Alright. But yeah, we need to go back there and just kind of investigate, see if we can find any information about that one person that supposedly has Jack. So, this might be good. We might be far enough now. Might as well take off our face reveal. Or reveal our face, I guess. <laughs> Alright, well, we have a $5 bounty there. Just need to follow the railroad. And we'll be getting back to the P.O. or uh, the post office, and of course we can pay off our bounty no problem, as well as our bounty over in New Hanover, so that's not going to be too big of a deal. Seven dollar what? How did my bounty go up? Whatever, not that big of a deal, sheesh. Seven dollars <laughs> fifty. Like, I'm like, it's not even that bad, but especially because we have heckin' three thousand dollars, but sheesh. All for basically nothing. All because I called a heckin' cop a pig, and accidentally ran into some other guy, and we well, started fist fighting him. Ah, alright, well not too big of a deal. Let me just go pay this thing off pretty easily, I'd say so. Well, let's just go take care of this here bounty. Man, it's really foggy and nasty here, you can barely even see. Anyways, let's go to the post office. Or, yes, post office. <laughs> I always keep calling it P.O. Box, but whatever, post office. Let's go pay off our bounty here, and I guess continue looking for the fellow that knows information about Jack, and hopefully we come across someone who quite literally knows Jack. <laughs> oh, little pun right there, don't arrest me, please. Oh, that's my- oh, I can get my alligator skin, it's still over here, whoa! I don't really care though, who cares? Quite the bounty you acquired, ain't it? Yep, 750 and 125 and you hand over, took care of both of them, hey do. Alright, well, I guess might as well go ahead and sell that alligator skin. Help pay for the bounty even though we have tons of money already, right? Sheesh. But now we're home free, we should- jeez, how long have we had this thing? Well, like, we had this alligator skin and then had an altercation with some guy? who probably did some sort of demonetizable action to our unconscious body, and then lost a dollar, and then went through all that shenaniganry, and... Like, jeez, this, this alligator skin has been with us for so long, like, I don't want to part ways with it. <laughs> you know? But, alas, we have to. <gasps> Goodbye, alligator skin. What's wrong with you? What in the world are you talking about? This'll get you? Hey, partner. How you doing? Well, it's been better. Well, hope your luck improves. <laughs> I'll be seeing you. That guy was just yelling at me like two seconds ago. Now we're all friendly. <laughs> Sell the stuff. Well, we'll you'll see how much we get from it. We still get a dollar forty. Not bad. I wonder if that's any bad. I don't know if I still have the. Hold on. Let's go to player. Let's go to Arthur. I'm probably still like underweight. I, I bet my horse is. Yeah, I'm underweight. My horse is probably still underweight. How's my honor doing though? Uh, yeah, store price is negative ten percent. Yeah. It seems like we only get better prices whenever we're buying. Doesn't seem like that's the case. Uh, let's see. Otherwise, physique. Malnourished. Yeah, we need to feed the horse. I, I'm like, I try and feed it pretty often with like random stuff to get its cords up and stuff, but I guess I'm going to have to keep feeding it like right here. Uh, feed, yes. Yep. Then brush and pat and all that kind of stuff. Definitely want to keep, keep, take care of our horse and stuff, you know? Especially right now, it's only at bonding three, and if we keep on taking care of it like this, surely it's going to go up to bonding four, and we'll be fully bonded with this horse, which will be great. We can whistle at it from greater distances, even though we've really never had problems with Come it. Come on, girl. And of course, get some ability to like strafe left and right and stuff, which is kind of cool. I've basically never used it, but it's pretty cool nonetheless. And we can just pat, pat All our ear. Right, girl. I think we'll be fine. Yeah. Hey, partner. Hey there, feller. Oh, there we go. There, girl. I'm gonna feed her one more time, and I think we'll be fine. And I need to feed myself, because I'm underweight, too. Classic oat cakes. Golly, that's expensive as heck. Better enjoy that. Sheesh. All right, can I eat horse cargo? Yeah, I want to eat my own food, though. There you go. Eat this. Sure, why not? Playing big game. Nice. Ate it in one bite. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's go to the uh, saloon, and let's go. Uh, any, and whatever, whatever the nearest one is. Let's go look. Which one? Uh, yeah, whatever. That one. The, that's the original one we were heading to anyways. <laughs> we couldn't go there because we had heckin' attention on us. I don't know if we had a bounty just yet, but we had like, police attention on us, so we couldn't even hey, go friend. in the bar. 
Come here a minute. Trust me. You want to hear this. Oh, jeez. What is it? Hey, you interested in some quick money? I am talking real quick. Whoa. Yeah, now, it's too open here, but, um, follow me and mm. we'll chat. Okay. Could be interesting. You're right about that. All right, so here's what I have in mind. <laughs> I knew something like that I would happen. Find these damn idiots. You can just tell with some folk. Come on, let's see what he has and dump him somewhere. Oh my god, I lost 3k. <laughs> oh man. Let me guess, I lost all of it, huh? Somehow I still have my guns. Health core's empty. We'll watch, I bet I lost like a dollar and that's it. I'm in the grave. Plus 750. Man! Golly! Yeah, see that? How, every time you have like a lot of money, it scales up whenever stuff like that happens. Sheesh. Yeah, that's one way for you to get a lot of money there, sir. Is that the fella? <clears throat> Mister? Get a load of this rube. Decent town you got here. Huh? Well, I'll leave you to it. Later. Sounds like a child. What in the world? Can I not get my stuff back? I don't know if I can or not. Whatever. I'm going to eat like a... Whatever. One of these. Sheesh. We lost a lot of money there, guys. Golly. 700-something dollars. Well, my cores are up again. I don't know if I can get my stuff back, though. Anyways. God, man. I need to avoid stuff like that. But I, at the same time, I always feel like I'm going to miss out on something. <laughs> and that's, that's one of the reasons why I, like, try and buy a lot of stuff whenever I have a lot of money, as well as, like, contribute to the camp and stuff, too. It's because whenever stuff like that happens, or when you die, uh, uh, what in the world? Or when you die, you end up losing more money, because it takes like a percent of your money, it seems like. So if you have like $3,000, you'll lose like, that's 700. Well, if you had like $20, you'd only lose like $3 or something stupid. Hey there, have you ever heard of a man called Angelo Bronte? Hmm, no. But fancy names like that? Maybe try the Bastille Saloon, opposite the park with the Quincy Harris statue. Okay. Thank you. Hmm. Which one? Oh, it's already marked on the map. Uh, it's not the one we originally intended to go to then, huh? Yeah, gotta go there. To the Angelo Bronte one. Alright, well, good information from these fellers. I'm still pretty far away from my horse, but he can hear me from here, which is good. What is this place? Oh, this is the barber right here. Yeah, he's closed. It's too late for him, yep. Man! Even after we lost $700, we still have like two hacking grand on us right now. Sheesh. Surely we can go to like ammunition shop or something like that and drop a pretty good amount of that money or go buy a new outfit or something but here we go we can go to the saloon it's probably closed but it is a saloon so you think it would be open at late time oh jeez stick him up cowboy <laughs> yeah. yeah real funny Dutch oh I thought so so here we are in a strange land of papists and rapists. America's very own Gamora. This yeah, city's all of the same to me. So, how you get on? I've been asking around about Mr. Bronte. And from what I've heard, this establishment is our best lead, but I haven't had any joy in there so far. So, I should just give it a shot? I think so. Just keep it cool. You know me? I'll meet you back here or not. Hmm. All right. We'll be shittier dwellers. Hey there, fellers. Everyone's looking at me. Sheesh. Hey, how's it going? How you guys doing? You guys don't all, all have Lenny faces, so that's good. Funny you should say that. <laughs> well, you know how it is. Hey, can I get I a drink? Him, I say that's the state of Lamorn for you, America's dirty little over here. <laughs> <laughs> that's why we love it. Born and raised. Mm. Well, I'm sorry. Please excuse me. I, I, I seem to have some very impatient customers. <laughs> now, how can I help? You look like a whiskey man. Sure. Dollar, please. For a whiskey? Oh, that's the real stuff. From Scott. Okay. Here, have one for yourself. Well, thank you. Mm. Pretty good tip. So, mister, can I ask you a question? You ever hear of a fella by the name of Bronte? <laughs> Who's asking? Me. I'm asking. No, leave it, friend. What do you mean, leave it? Look, I don't know what business you in, but leave it, friend. You and your pal that was in here before. Hmm. Just have to ask someone else, maybe? Bronte? 
Angelo Bronte. Mr. Big, Mr. Italian spaghetti eating long streak of piss big. Yeah, he makes my skin crawl. I'm so swarthy, a cocksucker. You know what I mean, friend? Where can I find him? Oh, well, I reckon you can talk to them kids in the alley. They'll know I guess. Again, with the people in the alley. Yeah, that's not happening. Oh, hey, seven. friend. You'll you be careful now. Immigrants, they're not to be trusted. I need to get rid of my waypoint marker. Sheesh. It's going to confuse me. There we go. Oh, well, we're going in the alleyway again. Man, it's suddenly daytime, too. Now I have my guns, son. Only these. Uh, oh, yep, I got both of them. Well, watch out. We're going to get heckin' robbed again. I don't want to be careful back here, I say. Not seeing anything just yet. Nothing on a equal eye, it seems. Seems like we're fine thus far, yep. I don't know, probably climb up one of this. It's really become quite the craze. Whoa. So you just walk up to any man with a ring on his finger and turn it three times? Yes. And then after 24 men find any married person, male or female, wearing a wedding ring, turn that ring twice, and then the next man you shake hands with will become your husband. What nonsense. <laughs> Don't take my word for it, then. You're Hi there. Have you seen any kids around here? Oh, yeah. Just through that archway there. <laughs> How do they know? I'm hiding behind... <laughs> Lucky for him, he didn't have a ring on his finger. Shut up! There's some kids right there. Street kid. Hey, there's Jack. Whoa. I don't think it is. Hey! Hey, you got a cigarette, mister? Maybe. Huh? I'm looking for a fellow named Angelo Bronte. Italian. I know him. Everyone knows him. Where is he? We'll take you to him. What old cost? I reckon I can pay. Five dollars. Where's he live? New York? I'm an entrepreneur. If you don't want to pay, then I don't want to walk. Oh, man. Awesome buy bread. Here. Come on. This away. Let's go, mister. You coming, Cleet? I wonder what happened if I couldn't afford that. Stay close. Easy to get lost around here. Come on, then. You new to the city, mister? Pretty much. Don't worry. No one knows it as good as me and Cleet. Is that right? Hope he won't need his services, but you got the doctor on the corner there. Nice enough, fella. That's Baird and Schreiber on the right there. Famous bookstore. Not that I'm much of a reader myself. Now over here is a real piece of art. That's the Church of the Holy Blessed Virgin, mister. Modeled on the famous church in Toulouse, which is in France. You been to Toulouse, mister? No. We're Catholics here, mister. Ain't Baptist or nothing. My mama said they used to burn Protestants and all, but uh, we all friends now. Isn't that the most beautiful testament to God's love for us all? They don't have nothing so fine where you come from, mister. Look at them fine steeples. Uh -oh. Hey, hey, <laughs> you little pair of shits. Get going. He's coming after us. Oh, jeez. Ah, did I just get robbed of all I did? He, oh, well, there goes the rest of my money, you guys. I just lost 3K right there. Sheesh. <laughs> lost 700 earlier. Lost another heckin' 21, 2200 or so just seconds ago. Oh, my God. Am I not... I guess I couldn't jump on it. Oh man, we're going to keep running. Hopefully I have pretty good stamina to keep up with that heckin' tree car. Just oh man. Give it up, boy. You better stop right now. Yeah, see, uh, that'd be really good if you could... Oh yeah, I might as well cut this corner, uh. Come on, run like the goats got loose. You give that back. I think you can call your horse over. I'm trying right now and it, it's not working. <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, see, I really wish you could just store money up at your camp or something, but it doesn't seem like that's the case. I guess I have to chase the second kid around, huh? There he is. Street trash. There he is. You after that kid? How the shit went that way? Let's go. Thanks for the help, friend. Let's see if I can catch him on Eagle Eye. Nah. Let's see if I can ask this feller. Hey, you! Slow up now! You know, I kind of miss old Bob Tails. I don't. Bounce around so much. Couldn't even. Hey, you see a kid about 14 years old run through here? 
Why, yes, we did. He went around the corner there. All right. Thanks a lot, mister. That's enough. Come here. Hey, moron. Oh, gee. Oh, well, here he is. Here he is. I'm looking at the minimap. Thanks for the minute map. <laughs> Or else I would have been chasing that heckin' Uh-oh. Oh, man. Hop it. Hop it. Go. Hey there. Happy it wasn't me. What? <laughs> go, 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 go. Chance in hell, slow poke. Man, parkour, Assassin's Creed memes. Don't you have pigs to feed? Is he on the roof? Oh, I think he is. Oh, he jumped down. He's on the other side. You're making a fool of yourself. Oh my god, well, I don't blame the kid for running all this far. For heckin' 2k. You can buy a heckin' house with that money, jeez. Golly. Melee? Hey there, mister. <laughs> hey, there, mister. Search for the kid. I'm telling you, a cucumber's definitely a fruit. Stands for when. Fellas, you seen a kid come through here? About 14, 15? Oh, yeah, he ran right to us. Ran around the corner there. All right. Thank you very much, sir. I won't run? forget the sight. Oh, jeez, there he is. Nice, he gave himself away. <laughs> oh, jeez. I just ran into the... <laughs> Whoops. I just ran into a woman. <laughs> Knocked her over. <laughs> Yo, nice. There he is again. What if I could actually catch this kid? Or it's impossible. Hmm. What's the problem, friend? Give me my things, boy. What are you talking about, friend? I ain't your friend, but that kid is, and he robbed from me. Now give me back my stuff and take me to Angelo Bronte. Senor Bronte. That kid was going to show me before he robbed me. <gasps> Ow. Come on. You new in town, mister? Come on. Mr. Bronte's got a lot of friends, mister, but I ain't never seen you. We ain't friends. You don't like no one, mister. Mr. Bronte, he's got fine hair. He got a beautiful house, and I am proud to work for him. He got 50 men, mister. Why are you gonna care a thing about you? I just want to speak with him. <laughs> I'm sure you do, mister. You and them friends of yours been asking about him all over town. He been mighty disrespected. Bunch of muddy Yankees in town asking questions. <laughs> well, you and your friend should pay him a visit, mister. He's got a big house on Flavian Street opposite the park. Hey, yokel. Now, get out of here. Disgusting. Let me guess, I only have $100. Oh my god! Oh wait. Sheesh, I thought he took my stuff. I thought I physically saw him take stuff, but okay. That's good. Didn't lose anything there, I guess, huh? Let me go back there and... Oh! They're all gone! Whoa, they disappeared! Whoa! Spooky. I guess they were ghosts. Maybe that's why they didn't take my money, because they never existed in the first place. <laughs> hey there! Uh, good morning to you. Good morning. Cornwall? Ugh. Spit on it. Get on the trolley? Yep. Sure, why not? Hey there, fellers. Did he just hit someone? Oh my god, he hit my fucking hole. Oh my. What? What? Yeah, I can hit my horse. Oh, my horse is not dead. Okay, that's good. Okay. Sheesh. <laughs> Get on the horse then. Oh my god, my horse is running away from me. It knows it almost died. Golly. Oh, oh my god. Why is it, why do people always like run into me? Like that guy like fell backwards into me. <laughs> Jeez. It always happens. Alright, well let's go around the corner here. Yep. And Flavian Street or something like that. I'm like, I'm not looking at street signs or anything like that. I'm just following where this is. This way, Arthur. Where? Anything, anyone. Oh, there he is. Me, There's please Dutch. Help me. Please. You. Yes. Please. Coin, please. Yeah, I'm not talking to you. Please. Where you been? Getting robbed? Who by? Bunch of children. <laughs> I won't inquire anymore. But I found Mr. Bronte. Seems to be some Italian Mr. Big in town. 
Everybody knows him, but nobody wants to talk about him. Apparently lives in a big house on Flavian Street, opposite the park. Huh. Good work. So what now? We go pay him a visit. I'll get John, you meet us there. Whatever it takes, we need to get that boy back. I cannot decide which I like less. The swamps or the city. Both are full of parasites, reptiles, and slime. We're a long way east of land we know, and far from real open country. Yep. The joys of civilization. Let me guess. Yeah, I can do that a lot faster, huh? Yeah, I'll complete. How would I complete that? It's basically hacking mission on rails. Just chasing some kid, catch the street urchin before he reaches the market. I don't think I. Is that even possible? I don't even know if it is, unless I got on my horse, which doesn't seem like it's possible because my horse wouldn't come to me. 